Watch the seasons pass us by Didn't know how they would form us For such a time as this as I stand here today, I'm overwhelmed with happiness to see Kim embarking on this new chapter of life with Daniel. Kim, you deserve all the happiness in the world, and I'm so grateful that you found someone who cares and cherishes you as much as Daniel does. And Daniel, I'm so happy to officially welcome you into the family. You felt like a brother for years, so the only difference is it's legally binding now. Daniel, you're one of the kindest and most genuine souls I've had the privilege to meet. While you're both very different people, you bring a healthy balance to Kim's life. You're the calmness to her crazy, but you're crazy enough to marry my sister. The good thing is, thank you. The good thing is you have to be missing a few screws to be a part of our family. I hope you have as much fun growing old with her as I did growing up with her. As long as you are standing here with me, that's all I need. I want it all. Daniel, you're my brother, my best friend. I'm so proud of the man you've become and all you've accomplished, and I'm honored to be here as your best man, and I'm honored to be your older brother. I love you, bro. All right, Kimmy. You really do look beautiful, I must say. Everybody clap for the bride. She looks beautiful, right? Everybody clap for her. Clap for the bride. Kimmy, from the moment I met you and I saw you and my brother together, I had a feeling this day would come. When I first met you, I saw a strong, articulate, beautiful, fearless 20-year-old, 24-year-old girl whom I clearly knew my brother was head over heels in love with. And then years went by and I got to know you and I, I learned that you were also kind, gentle, hardworking, disciplined, and you've grown into a beautiful young woman. Pretty much everything my brother needs and wants in a, in a wife. And after meeting and get to knowing you know, your family and your side of the family, I can't be more excited and, and just congratulate in the new chapter in your guys' life that's opening. And you're all such wonderful people. It's an honor to meet you. And you know, a man's mother sets the standards for the woman that he chooses to share his life with. 
And we had a really amazing mother. And the fact that you're here to, today, Kimmy, shows how great of a person you are and how good of a wife you will be to my brother. And we've laughed together, we've cried together, and today we're going to celebrate our families becoming one together. Looking at you now, it's obvious, it's meant to be. Don't have to try, it comes naturally. There's just no denying when stars align. Daniel loved his mom, loves his dad, and everyone knows that how a son treats his mom is how he'll treat his wife. Dan, just so you know that you're not here alone, though you won't be alone, as proof behind all the women that dance with you today, your mom would have been proud, your mom would have been happy, and we all know that she's here and she's smiling with you. Kim little girl. Inside joke, by the way. Uh, you're an amazing person. We all know that Daniel is lucky to have you. That's not much. There's not much that I can say about you that you or anyone hasn't probably already heard. But uh, I don't know. I don't know if anyone knows, but Kim is very competitive. I, no? Nobody? Okay. She is. She's very competitive. And Probably the only girl that I know that could probably beat me in an arm wrestling match. Just, just give you guys a heads up. We, one time we played basketball. One time we played basketball and she bodied the living hell out of me. It was scary. I promise. It was, it was scary. You're a natural caregiver, which is why you're an amazing nurse. And like Daniel, you are just as brave. You're just as strong. And now you're also my sister. You're going to be a great wife and someday a great mom. Welcome to the team. You're one of us now. To you both, say I love you, not just because you say it, but because you mean it. Never go to bed angry at each other. And remember, patience is a virtue. You may not always agree, you may not always get along with each other, but always be patient. First page, a story starts here.
In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, the Lord be with you. We have come rejoicing into the house of the Lord for this celebration, my dear brothers and sisters. And now we stand with Daniel and Kimberly on the day they intend to form a home of their own. For them, this is a moment of unique importance. So let us support them with our affection, with our friendship, and with our prayers as their brothers and sisters. Let us listen attentively with them to the word that God speaks to us today. And then, with Holy Church, let us humbly pray to God the Father, through Jesus Christ our Lord, for this couple, his servants, that he lovingly accept them, bless them, and make them always one. Dearly beloved, you have come together into the house of the church so that in the presence of the church's minister and this community, your intention to enter into marriage may be strengthened by the Lord with a sacred seal. Christ abundantly blesses the love that binds you. Through a special sacrament, he enriches and strengthens those he has already consecrated by holy baptism, that they may be faithful to each other forever and assume all of the responsibilities of married life. And so, in the presence of the Church, I ask you to state your intentions. Daniel and Kimberly, have you come here to enter into marriage without coercion, freely and wholeheartedly? Yes. Are you prepared as you follow the path of marriage to love and honor each other for as long as you both shall live? Yes. yes. <laughs> Are you prepared to accept children lovingly from God and to bring them up according to the law of Christ and His Church? Yes. yes. Since it is your intention to enter the covenant of holy matrimony, join your hands and declare your consent before God and His Church. So, I, Daniel, take you, Kimberly, to be my wife. I, Daniel, take you, Kimberly, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love you and to honor you. To love you and to honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. I, Kimberly, take you, Daniel, to be my husband. I, Kimberly, take you, Daniel, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love you and to honor you. To love you and to honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. May the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob, the God who joined together our first parents in paradise, strengthen and bless in Christ the consent you have declared before the church, so that what God joins together, no one may put asunder. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Now let us say the prayer over the rings. May the Lord bless these rings, which you will give to each other as a sign of love and fidelity, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Kimberly, receive this ring. Kimberly, will you take this ring? As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Daniel, receive this ring. Daniel, receive this ring. As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. May you be witnesses in the world to God's charity, so that the afflicted and needy who have known your kindness may one day receive you thankfully into the eternal dwelling of God. Amen. May the Almighty God bless you and keep you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. The celebration is over. Let's go in peace.
thanks be to God. Congratulations. And at this point, it is my privilege to introduce and to present you our newlyweds, Daniel and Kimberly. Tonight 
Like a picture that I've painted in my wildest dreams Came to life in every feeling that you gave to me Found a story that we saw 